Two people are now facing drug and child endangerment charges after they overdosed on heroin. And if it were not for a seven-year-old girl, they likely would not be alive today. Ross Gadotti has the story now new at 6. The incident happened in the upstairs of that building, and we spoke to a neighbor who was on scene, and he tells us the two people found unresponsive would have ended up dead if not for the actions of a seven-year-old girl. Joe Riccardi arrived on the second floor of 601 Pennsylvania Avenue in Rochester after hearing screams for help. What he would see next was a scene of desperation. The lady was passed out on the floor and uh, the guy was passed out in the bathroom. The male identified as 26-year-old David Luchik, the female, 35-year-old Christina Somerville. Both apparently overdosed on heroin, the street name for this brand, Killing Time, and it was about to live up to its title. She wasn't breathing, so I started resuscitating her um, and got her going. According to Riccardi and court documents, it was Christina Somerville's seven-year-old daughter whose actions would keep both from dying. She is the one that found her mother on the floor unconscious, and she called her father. I brought the little girl downstairs and sat out here. She was actually the hero. I think she was fantastic. I mean, at her age, I think she's only seven or eight years old. She knew to call her father because there was something wrong. Paramedics administered Narcan to counteract the heroin. Somerville and Lutick would recover. More than a dozen stamp bags of the drug were found inside the apartment. Both individuals are now in the Beaver County Jail on drug and child endangerment charges. Meanwhile, Riccardi hopes Christina Somerville realizes this. The mother owes the daughter her life. We spoke to William Harris. He owns the building where this all took place. He told us he is left with no alternative but to evict those living there in the wake of what happened. He also says he hopes the woman gets the help she needs and the daughter finds someplace safe to live. In Rochester Borough, Ross Gadotti, KDKA TV News.